So, this is not the Sunday video I thought I'd be filming, but here we are. I've been swatching nibs for my cola ring dippers, specifically because while not while I was at Chicago, I found it really hard to not exactly know what I had in my collection. I had to keep referencing my spreadsheet, which I found hard on the show floor because there wasn't super consistent Wi-Fi. And I really enjoyed having all my colors on the dippers, and so I went, you know what, we're just gonna take a couple cards and put the nibs and all the pens I own on dippers. So the front has the nibs, and the back have the pen name and the color. It's working super well. So I've been doing that today, but while I've been doing that, I've also been filming the content for all of the new pens that I got at Chicago. And I reached for a pen that I thought was clean, and it wasn't. And I dipped it in a bottle of ink, and that has presented an issue because I have created a color that I am obsessed with. I love this color. It's fabulous. It's sort of exactly what I want in a purple, uh, where it's moody, but it's not super dark. And it's mellow and it's muted. It's like a really saturated uh, Madame Mulberry. Issue is, I don't know what the pen was dipped in. So I've literally pulled every pink, purple, blue from my palette and ink collection, even colors that I haven't used since I got the pen because who knows, maybe we'll create something else that's cool. So this is going to be the video that people keep asking for. This is going to be a Let's Mix Inks video. I have one of the new Chicago pens. I've got my Twisby Eco in abroad. We're just gonna dip it in what we create and swatched in this book. The goal is though creating something similar to this because I really like it. I think it was probably Sailor Gentle, Eroi, which is not how you say it. And then this blue from Ferris Wheel Press. We're gonna try and see what happens. So let's get into this. So with the color swatch cards, I've actually set them up so they start at blue because I don't need, there's some of the other colors that I just don't need. So we have Lil Sample Vial and Sailor Gentle in the color that I can't pronounce. I bought this as an open bottle because they no longer come in 50 ml bottles and they are no longer called the Gentle Inks. They're under a different line now, but you can still purchase them. And I think, I think it's probably this. But who knows? There may also be some random other color thrown in. Because I am super good at cleaning my stuff. So all those people that have been asking for ink mixing videos for months are finally getting it because I was lazy, or not lazy. I thought I had cleaned a pen and I hadn't. Um, so, sure, I'm gonna say that's enough red. It's gonna be the color I want. Probably not, in all honesty. Try that. Hmm. I think you're still too red. Do I have Q-tips? Still, I do. I do still have Q-tips. Excellent. destroy this page by swatching right underneath. We are too red still. I already know this. Oh yeah. So red still. Okay. We might add some navy from Sailor. Sorry, Sailor Blue Black. 
this doesn't work. Mm, we might have to add some sailor blue black to this. All right. And maybe you're the wrong pink. Honestly, that could be part of the problem. And I don't have a trash can near me. Are you just the wrong pink? Potentially. The thing is, I don't think I would have dipped it into multiple colors. So. Let's just see what you're like with a little bit of blue-black added. Though I don't think I would have dipped you into both when I did you initially. Hmm. My rinse water is a very pretty purple now. Let's see if you have a pretty purple. If you're still... It's like weird color. That is an awful. Hello, ink that's actually probably going in that Twisby broad, actually. Um, okay. So, it's test number one. Test number two is going to be a very different pink. It's going to be this Diplomat one. But we're actually going to start with adding the Sailor Blue Black. I think this is our trick for that pretty color. I could ink multiple pens. I've got stuff cleaning, so... I really like a couple of them. I could ink a couple of them. I don't know that I will though. So this Diplomat one is very hot pink. And I pretty much only bought it because it was an Atlas last chance. Uh, it's a bit too pink for me normally, but it is quite pretty. So let's see what this swabs out to be. We are too purple. I don't hate you, but I also don't love you. Um, what could I add to you? Just mellow you out a bit. like ignoring all the color theory but not really so we're gonna add this go so that's going in a pen um so it's really pretty and i'm gonna have to you know come back to this video someday to figure out how i made it because i like it I wonder if that will give it the undertone that I want, which is just like slightly more pink and less angry. It's not angry, it's just too grape. Yeah, I like that better. Go, so it's that that's going in the pen. So we are going to ink this Twisby for the first time, which I have not done. Didn't think I was going to be inking the Twisby today, but here we are.
sure. Here we go. Twispies inked. The first time I ink, this was going to be a shimmer ink. What was this? This was Sailor. WP. Blue. And Sailor. It's not how to spell it. How do you spell it? Uh, um. That's very pretty. All right. Wow. Welcome to the first time I've ever custom mixed inks. Super enjoyable. I get why people kept telling me to do it because it was a whole lot of fun. Uh, and I will definitely be doing it again. Now I have to go do swatches of these so that at a future date I can remake them because this was a lot of fun. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know what your favorite inks are to mix together because I am definitely going to be doing this again. It was so much fun.